Hi everyone, my name is Otis. You're welcome to Otaliums Academy. So in today's video, we're going to walk you through how to install WordPress plugin for your WordPress blog or WordPress website. So uh, in our last presentation, we talked about uh, how to create your WordPress, how to create your blog. So we are going deeper by uh, walking you through how to install plugins to beautify your website to make it look attractive but before i get before i uh, before i go deeper i just want to say thank you for all of you that have subscribed to my youtube channel and if you have not done that please just hit the subscribe button so um so we're going back to where we are about uh, uh installing wordpress uh, plugin so the wordpress plugin is just a, a piece of uh, software containing different functions that can be that can add new features to your website so like as i said wordpress that's what makes wordpress one of the best content management system because you can import different plugins to set up your website so here i've already set up my blog i've already set up my website but i needed i need an added uh, feature or functionality uh, so what do I do? I have to go to the plugin section to import or install, upload or search for a plugin that could suit that need. So I'm going to log in into my WordPress website to upload or install this plugin. So uh, at this point in time, I assume that you already have your website, your your website or your blog running. So I'm logging into my blog to my website to install the plugins so so it is actually loading so i'm just waiting for my website to get into my website so i've logged as soon as you logged into log on into your wordpress website so the next thing that you have to do by default, it takes you into the dashboard directly. So on the dashboard, so I'm going to look for the plugin section, then add new. So I'm just going to do that right away. So I'll scroll down, I'm looking for plugin. Here is a plugin now. So I'm going to add new on this plugin section here. If I click add new, so it's going to take me to the plugin section where I can search for the plugin that I need to beautify my website. So you scroll down a little bit here, you see where it tells you to search plugins. So, and there's a keyword. So the keyword is, what is the name of this of, of, of the plugin that you want to install? But now I don't have any at hand and I don't even know. So I'm just going to put the generic uh, uh, keyword like social, social share, because I'm looking for a plugin that can help me to share my content from my website directly to my social network like Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. So I'm going to put social social sharing to see if it's going to bring uh, the, the plugins that, that that might be helpful to me. Yes, so it's able to populate the different plugins. So you can go through this different plugin to see the one that you like. But uh, what I do is that I look at the recent updates, the last updated dates for that plugin. Then I look at the number of uh, active installation. So, and that's why then I just, I don't want to do, I don't want to do a try, a try and error. So I just want to go to the one that has been established. I know that before they can have that large subscriber of active users, probably they might have stand the test of time. So now I'm going to go to with this because it has, uh, it has so okay so this is already installed so um okay so i'm going to go with this so i already have this social sharing so i'm going to install this so it is installing so i'm going to wait for it to install so like i said said i need a plugin that will help me to share my content directly from my website to my uh, social network like facebook twitter instagram so it is already installed so the next thing to do is to click activate so once i hit activate so that's going to activate the plugins so once that happens i'll just go into my plugin section to actually see if it is properly installed if it is installed then i am good to go so i'll begin my the customization of my website and see 
that this plugin is fully set up. So, so I think it is fully activated. So I'm just going to go to install plugin again to see if I have that. This is the name of the plugin, WordPress Social Sharing by Sassy Social. So I'm going back down to the plugin to make sure that I have that. I have that on. So once that is done, then I've completed the installation of my plugins. So I'm searching for it. So social. Searching for it. I'm scrolling down to find where it is. So social 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 sharing. So I have that here. So social media and share icons, ultimate social media. So I already have this. So I'm going to go into the setting to make sure that it is fully set. It is fully set up so I can actually share my content using the, uh, the this plugin, the social share or the social icon to distribute my content. So, okay. So what do you do here? So I'm going to go back to this point here. So. We're going to set that up here. So this is how the plugin, this is it. This is the social share. So welcome to Optimus Social Share. So I'm still using the free one. So this is what I tell you which icon do you want to show on your website. So you want to look at it. So you can select the icon how you want it to appear on your website. So you can select this one if that's the way you want it to show uh, below your content. So that's how it is. So I think I'm coming to the end of this uh, install this uh, presentation of installing uh, your plugin to your website to beautify and customize your website. So you look at all this, you just follow the prompt. If you like it, if you want to leave it by default, or you just hit, just hit this button, save all settings. So once you save that, it's going to show up on all your content. So with one click, you can actually uh, distribute your content. So I just want to say thank you for listening to this presentation. And again, don't forget to, to hit the subscribe button. So I look forward to see you in our next presentation. Do have a great day.